Welcome to West Hills College Lemoore's orientation. Following the end of this online orientation, there will be a short quiz. The following slides will cover orientation information for West Hills College Lemoore to help you get strong, start strong, stay strong, and finish strong. Our administration building is located at the front of our campus. The Administration Student Services Building 100 hours of operation are from 7.30 a.m. to 5 p.m. Located in this building is the President's Office, the Vice President of Student Services, Counseling, Advising, Financial Aid, and other instructional services and staff. The Financial Aid Office, located in the Administration Building, is open from 7.30 a.m. to 5 p.m. on Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, and walk-ins are encouraged. 10 a.m. to 5 p.m. on Wednesdays, and 7.30 a.m. to 12 p.m. on Friday. The types of aid available are grants, California College Promise Fee Waivers, Federal Work Study, Scholarships, and Loans. Important deadlines to remember are October 1st is the FAFSA is available, January through March 1st are for scholarships, March 2nd is Cal Grant Entitlement, and September 2nd is Cal Grant Competitive. Before completing your FAFSA online, you will need to create your personal FSA ID PIN number. Once you have your PIN, you can go to the Student Aid website to complete your FAFSA. It could take up to 10 days for the college to receive your documentation. Completing your FAFSA is only step one. Apply online today. Your West Hills College email account is the way that we notify you about financial aid information. Check your West Hills College email account several times a week. There may be documents you will need to complete before we can award you, so check your My West Hills portal and student email regularly after you complete your FAFSA online. West Hills College Lemoore offers zero-cost textbooks for over 300 courses. Students don't have to pay for parking, and if you're eligible for the California Promise Grant, you will not have to pay for your unit. The California Promise Program Enrollment Fee Waiver, formerly known as the Board of Governor Waiver, is provided to students who are California residents or AB 540, have completed a free application for federal student aid or California dream application, and are first-time full-time students enrolled in 30 units for the academic year. West Hills College of Moore has policies and procedures in place to help students be aware of their academic performance. These policies and procedures lead to activities and workshops. The following are the academic policies. Academic probation policy. Receive lower than a 2.0 GPA. A1 is probation of the first term. A2 is probation of the second term. And AD is dismissal. Progress probation policy. One third of students have grades of W, withdraw. I, incomplete, or N, P, no pass. P1 equals progress probation first term. P2, Progress Probation Second Term. PD, Dismissal. Course Repetition. Can repeat a course up to three times if an NP, D, or F grade was earned. The third time you will need to petition to repeat. Original grade remains on transcript. Better grade calculated into GPA. Drop Policy. Students' responsibility to drop a class, classes online. Academic Expectations Maintain a 2.0 GPA on all attempted coursework. Academic Expectations Maintain a 2.0 GPA on all attempted coursework with 12 or more accumulated units. West Hills College Lemoore wants to help you start strong. Our pre-enrollment services are designed to help you with all of your registration components so that you can have a smooth transition from high school to college. The following processes will lead you to a successful journey. The pre-enrollment application for admission to West Hills College Lemoore. The orientation, the registration to enroll in classes, complete a student education plan, and succeed and meet your educational goal. Priority registration. Registration 365, register now and pay later. $46 a unit. Login to My West Hills account on the website. Know your username, your first and last name, 
There might be a number after your name if your name is more common. Know your password. My six-digit birthday, last four numbers of your social. All incoming students need to complete their student educational plan. Call Student Services Department at 925-3317 to schedule an appointment to meet with your team counselor or advisor. The Student Education Plan will map out the courses you will need to take specific to your educational goals. It serves as a guide for you to expedite the completion of your classes towards your degree program. Once you have a plan, follow it. Take the courses you need in the correct order so that you can move forward with your academic goals. All continuing students must have a student education plan on file and may not be on second term academic progress probation. They must not also exceed 70 units. All new students must have completed orientation, an education plan, and a FAFSA or DREAM Act application. West Hills College and More has created a process for students to challenge the following. Write to challenge a prerequisite or co-requisite. If a student has successfully completed a course at another college, has the knowledge or ability to succeed without it, there is not a prerequisite or co-requisite course not readily available, or believe it is discriminatory or being applied in that manner, then step one, see a counselor. And step two, complete prerequisite co-requisite form and steps discussed by a counselor in a timely manner. Write to challenge a course. Earn credit by exam, 15 units maximum, and see a counselor. Write to file a student appeal or a complaint form. Forms available in the administration building. Write to safe and positive learning environment, free from harassment. Student co Code of Conduct. Contact Dean of Student Services Office immediately. Catalog Rights. A student must fulfill degree requirements as stipulated in the West Hills College of the Moore Catalog. A student who maintains continuous enrollment may elect the catalog in effect at the time of the student began attending a California college, the catalog in effect at the time the student began attending West Hills College of the Moore, or the catalog in effect at the time the student is graduated from West Hills College of the Moore. Continuous enrollment is defined as being officially enrolled each semester during an academic year, regardless of the number of units completed. Also, a student is considered to be in attendance even if he or she is registered and totally withdrew from the school during the semester term, as long as the official transcript so indicates. Our educational services are overseen by the Vice President of Instruction. The Instructional Office oversees hiring and evaluation of instructors, resolving questions regarding grades and attendance, integrity of curriculum, the course schedule, and course substitutions for graduation requirements. Student programs offered at West Hills College of Moore include, but are not limited to, the following. Disabled Students Program and Services, or DSPS. Services provided to students with educational limitations due to a physical, learning, or mental health impairments. Located in room 270. Extended Opportunity and Program and Services, EOPS. Services provided to low-income and educationally disadvantaged students to gain access to and successfully complete a program of higher education. Located in room 270. CalWORKS, services provided to students receiving cash aid from any county welfare agency, located in room 270. Military services, services provided for veterans, active military, spouses, and dependents, located in the administration building 100. Uh, counselors and advisors work together to support students within each specific major. Educational administrators and instructional faculty in your major are here to support you, along with counselors, advisors, financial aid staff, admissions and records staff, and registration staff. The Student Union is the newest building on our campus, located behind the administration building. 
the student union hours of operation are from 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. on Monday through Thursday and 7 a.m. to 5 p.m. on Fridays. You can get assistance with registration and class scheduling. Forms such as petitions are available here. Located in this building are the Dean of Student Services, the Equity Coordinator, the Student Help Desk for Student Services Technicians, Student Engagement Center, such as student success specialists and peer mentors, the bookstore, and Ville's Cafe. You can find academic support in the Learning Resource Center. West Hills College Lemoore's Library Services offer a wide variety of support, including the Academic Center for Excellence, or ACE, located in room 459, located in the Learning Resource Center. ACE is a place for students to gain tools and resources for their academic success. English, ESL, linguistics, math, and science instructors are available. Supplemental instruction students, current West Hills College No More students who lead SI sessions as well as provide drop-in tutoring. ACE provides a quiet and focused environment. Computer, printer, and scanner are available to help you get your assignments done in a timely manner. We can help you become a successful student by working smarter instead of harder. NetTutor is available online through Canvas, our learning management system. The Golden Eagle Workforce Internship Networking Center is located in room 275 and connects and supports their career pathways of all students and alumni by providing job listings, career workshops, and events, career assessment, employer networking opportunities, internships and activities that result in the establishment of our advancement of personalized career goals. Win Center Resources, Career Exploration, Job Readiness Workshops, and Job Speaker. Search for jobs in your career field and find events on campus. The following information breaks down the graduation requirements for the degrees offered at West Hills College Lamore. The Associate's Degrees, 60 units in courses numbered 1 through 99. PE requirement for students under 21. Associate's degree for transfer. 60 units in courses numbered 1 through 49. Completion of CSU, or GE, or IGETC. Transfer. Minimum 60 transferable units for CSU. Minimum 60 transferable units for UC. Courses are numbered 1 through 49. Independent and out-of-state university requirements may vary. Completing associate degree requirement does not necessarily mean you have completed transfer requirements. See counselor and develop an educational plan. Know your West Hills email. Primary communication between the college and yourself will be through your West Hills email, especially if you're taking online class or attempting to correspond with the campus. Remember that your email is always your first name and last name, all one word, at my.whccd.edu.